What do you do for a living? Um, I own a puppy store called, it's on Instagram, Your Puppy Kingdom. But I also just started back dancing about, I've been dancing about three weeks. I stopped for three years and now I'm back dancing about three weeks now. What kind of dancer? Stripper, dancing. Oh, dancing, you're dancing. Dancing, you're dancing. Dancing, dancing. Dancer, dancer. Do me a favor, try and pay attention, okay? Hello? Hi. Good night. Uh, She's fine. All right, I saw y'all say get the other girl. Y'all so rude. Y'all know y'all are so rude. For real. I'm fighting her back. That is her name. Y'all know y'all was gonna find the child. All right, so let's see if she answers. <laughs> they wanted you back, girl. They Look, I couldn't find your name. They want to go find you. Hello? <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, to be okay. Oh, uh, you doing the Kendra Cam already? Yes, okay, so I know I'm in the club. They hear me out. I am single, so, you know, when you're single, you go out. Okay, I, I, so I, I'm in the bathroom. I'm sorry, I'm in the club. I haven't been out in like six weeks, so I had to go out. Okay, so you want to start off with the Kendra Cam, I'm seeing. Okay, okay. Oh, look at that body. <laughs> Yo. Okay, so is it me or do that look like a BBL? I don't know. It's just something about her bottom looks kind of square. Like it's uh, <laughs> surgically implanted. Now the front, that's that's all mother nature. I, I, I can't even really say that. Um, but it looks natural to me. But the back, the backyard looks like it's BBL. I don't know. I, I noticed she didn't turn around totally. Uh, maybe she will later on. I don't know. I haven't seen this before, but uh, you know, the back looks suspect. I'll just put it that way. Let's go in. I'll put it back on you so we can have this conversation. Okay, okay. Oh, she done hung herself up, child. Let me try again, child. Oh my goodness, child. I ain't like she already in the club looking for another guy, so even you know. Who who say she ain't going to find, find her dude later on tonight? Uh, doing this at a club is probably not the best look. I'm just saying. Let's go in. Never worked this hard to talk to somebody. Um, but you got to get the people what you want, child. She highly requested. All right, let me try to call her again. Ooh, chat. Let's see if she answers. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I tried to I tried to turn the camera around. My bad, my bad. Okay. Okay. All right, what's your okay. name, honey? Um, it's Brittany Banks, but I go by Philly Banks. Okay, but you you go you want me to can I call you Brittany? Philly. I hate Brittany. I'll I'll call you reason. Philly. Okay. <laughs> okay, Philly. How old are you? I'm thirty two. I'm Thir a little old. Thirty that's not old. What is your birthday or zodiac sign? Three twenty one ninety. I'm an Aries. Your Aries. I'm a little fun, but you know. <laughs> um, Philly, 32, Aries. What do you do for a living? Um, I own a puppy store called, it's on Instagram, Your Puppy Kingdom. But I also just started back dancing about, I've been dancing about three weeks. I stopped for three years and now I'm back dancing about three weeks now. What kind of dancer? Stripper, dancing. Oh, dancing, you're dancing. You're dancing, dancing. 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 Dancer, dancer. What? Stripper, dancer. Dancer, dancer. She's at the club. She's a stripper. So there's a lifestyle that is being, um, I'm thinking about right now and what it, what it would take to be with her. You got to deal with the, the clubs. You got to deal with the, the strip clubs. You got to deal with all that if you want to be with her. Uh, she don't have no problem showing her assets so to speak uh 
I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Let's go in. Here's spring for me, honey. Okay, I think that might be better. So are you working right now? Yes, I own Your Puppy Kingdom on Instagram, and I also dance as well. I know. So I'm saying, are you at the club? Are you dancing at the club No, right no, 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 no. It, it was um, 50 Cent Wings or whatever it was tonight. So I can't <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if you're an owner of a puppy uh, place, um, why do you have to strip, really? Uh, I, don't, I don't, I'm not getting that part of it, but let's go in. Okay, okay. So you like to have a good time. You like to have a good time. I, well, I, I haven't been out in like six weeks, so. Did you have a baby? No. Well, I have a 17-year-old son and a 13-year-old son. You have and a 17-year-old? Yes, a senior this year, yes. I would never think you have a 17-year-old son. And a, and a what, 13-year-old? Yep, and I will not have no more kids, and I'm done. So let's do the math. 17, when she was 15? 14 or 15? When, uh, when she had him? <clears throat> wow. No judgment, I'm just saying. Wow. <laughs> You're done with kids. Are you yes. kids by the same man? Yes, when I, we was married. I got married very young at 16. Very, very young. You got married at 16? Yes. Uh, you can't make this shit up, folks. You cannot make this shit up. When did you get divorced? At 22 or 23, something like that. That's how old you was when you got divorced. Yeah. Aw, uh, was he older than you? Yes. Can I, can you share? If you were 16, how old was he? It's 20, maybe a 20, 21, something like that. Okay. You can get married at 16? Yes. Well, when you're pregnant. Yeah, when you're pregnant. <laughs> you, when you're pregnant at 14, the father's going to say, well, you got to marry her now, bro. You done, you done knocked up my daughter. You got to marry her at 14. And then she probably had the baby at 15. So... Yeah, um, I think the parents probably forced that. I, I don't know. Let's see what she say. And then you get your guardian to sign, and yeah. Oh, uh, so you was pregnant, your yep. guardianship signed, and then you got married. Yep. Okay. And then you had two children together and got divorced when you were 23. Yep. I think it was about 22, 23, yep. 22, 23. Great, great friends, though. Great, we're go, great co-parenting, no problem. You co-parent very well. Okay. Yep. So, um, all right, let's get into it. So this is Philly, 32, is the Aries, um, owns her own pet company or something? Your Puppy Kingdom, yeah, it's okay. on, I own 65 dogs, I'm a big breed. I'm in South Carolina, so I got this country accent going on. But Wait, do you live in, in South, where, do you, oh yeah, where are you calling me from? Columbia, South Carolina, but I was raised in Japan, actually, and I came to America in 2006. So where does Philly come in play? I was born in Philadelphia. Oh, okay. I was Puerto okay. Rican and black, and I was born in Philadelphia. Wait a minute. It's a lot going on. Hold on. You Puerto Rican and black. You was raised in Japan. You was born in Philadelphia. Were, are, were you some kind of army kid or something? Like, why? Where, what's, what's with all of them moving around from Philly to Japan? I wonder if her parents was in the military or something. Well, let's find out. Raised in Japan. I got this weird thing going on. <laughs> okay. Why was you raised in Japan? Was somebody in the military? Military, yep. Mm. Okay. Can you speak Japanese? I didn't see this before. The Just to guess. Amount, then you, you are, okay? <laughs> Look, the tiniest amount. <laughs> All right. So this is Philly. Um, she's, lives in South, she's in South Carolina. 32 Aries, two children, was once married, um, doesn't want any more kids. She's a stripper and she owns her own dog cattle business. What kind of man are you looking for, girl? Um, I'm not picky, but I prefer taller men. I'm only 5'2". I'm only 5'2", but I really like tall men. Tall like race. what? Like, if you're 5'2", would you date, is 5'9", to you tall? All my relationships have been like 6'9", 6'5". Um, yeah. Yeah. I prefer taller, but I'm not against, you know, I'm not really picky. I can't lie. You're not really picky. Okay. Really Does he picky. have to make a certain amount of money? Um, I feel the same as me. I feel like I'm, 
between everything that I do, I make like maybe a hundred, a hundred and twenty. Um, that would be awesome. Do you want a guy that makes between a hundred K and more? Yes. Okay. Could he have kids? Um, I have one baby daddy. So it would be so nice to find someone with one baby daddy or less. I'm not really big on baby mom. Five, four. That's, that's a lot. That's a lot. Okay. And you say you don't want any more children, right? No, no. No more kids for I her. I mean, I feel like my 17-year-old at some point, I feel like I'll be a grandma in maybe like five years. So five Are you going to have kids early? In like five years, I feel like. So, Why you, you know, say that? All right, I missed it. You say you, I, I, someone say I'm pretending like I didn't hear it. I, I did hear it. You want a guy that's 6'9"? Hello? Yeah, okay. okay I can't hear, hear you now. now. All right. Okay. Um, Philly. Yes. You say you want a guy that's 6'9"? No, no, no. I've dated 6'9", 6'5". It's normally, I'm 5'2", I know. Were they, were they professional athletes? Uh, one was, yeah. One was, okay. So you like men six feet and above? I prefer taller men. I'll just say that, but I'm not okay. against. I'm kind of curious right. about that. Like taller men, six nine, and she liked that. I mean, she must have been to. She only five two, so she must have been like to his waist. You know, maybe maybe under his armpit, in his, in the middle of his chest. Like wow, interesting. You already did the Kendra Cam. Do you want to do it again? We kind of already did okay. it. Let me not mess up. Let me hit the... Nah, okay. She, yeah. Okay. Now turn around. Look at that body, girl. My girl, girl, you look so good. You make me want to drink you up like a strawberry. It's like... It's like, it's like, it's like girl, can I get a slap? Missing it, baby. Oh, did I, did I, did I dribble a little bit? You dribbled a little bit. Girl, you're going to have me dribble all night, there. Go on, get on out of here. You make me come out to you that far. Have me dribbling in places I don't want to dribble. <laughs> What was your last relationship? Um, it's, I've been single about 13, 14 months, and it was about eight years long. Oh, your marriage, right? No, no, no. Mm -hmm. um, that was after. That, this is the one after. Okay. Uh, I'm always in back... long-term relationships. I've never been single before, so this is my first time single, honestly. Okay. Do you want to take it... Well why are you at the, I, I hope you ain't at the club looking for a dude. Hey, what's your problem? You can't call nobody. Girl, my probation thing's gonna be all right. You just lost the best thing that ever happened to you. Why, like, I, th that's the part I don't understand. Like, that that's, the club is not a place to find a guy. Like she said, she's been single, so that's why she's at the club. I mean, these are pretty much her words. So it seemed like she's looking for a guy in the club, and she just happened to get picked by Kendra, which is why she's doing this interview. But um, I don't know. It just I'm not saying anything is wrong with guys in the club, but I I don't think men really look in clubs to find a long term term girlfriend or wife like i don't think guys be like oh yeah my wife is at the club somewhere and she's she's also a stripper you know i i just don't think guys look at it like that but anyway let's go in i put the camera back in your face or you want to continue to talk to us like that it's up to you all right there you go um so when was the last time you was intimate with someone you don't have to answer uh, last answer. night so, oh this sounds terrible um and um, what does Ice Spice say? A muncher? A what? Um, what'd you say? A munch? A munch? A munch? When you don't give them none, but they just... It's called a oh, munch. so a guy went down on you three weeks ago. Yes. Got you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. So this is Philly, 32, um, South Carolina, no kids, Aries, stripper. Um, do you think... Um, and business owner. Don't and business it. owner. And business owner. I, but I, I, hope, about... I hope to be done, done dancing by March. I'm not going to lie. The mm -hmm. last dude I was with was a street dude.
and I put a lot of uh, a few things in my name for him that I shouldn't have done and so I came back dancing to kind of knock that out that's the fastest way to make money it honestly is so okay yeah. oh so you like did he go to jail no he's out he's just a, a piece of shit but why so you had things in your names but how did it mess you up um, I had things in my name for him that he no longer wants to pay, so I'm gonna pay and clear out and be done with it. And I figured if probably bought him a car, some stuff like that, or you know, uh, <laughs> bail bonds or something like that, and uh, put it in her name. And now she gotta strip strip that debt clean. And uh, she says she's gonna be done, so can't knock the hustle. You know, long as she gonna be done, I, you know, I, I, I kind of look at it different now. To be honest, if she's gonna be done in in what she say, whenever March or whatever, then um, I, I I'm the type of guy be like, eh, I, I, I can probably work with that, but I don't know. It's still kind of hard to to deal with any kind of stripper because if you get in into debt again, what 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 you think she's gonna do? She's going to go back to stripping because that's her that's her thing. So when she has any kind of debt or whatever, now if she's with me, she shouldn't have no debt. But at the same time, the mentality is something that I'm looking at. OK, this is how you solve problems. You go up and you strip and you get fast cash. Um, That's something to consider. It is. It is because at the end of the day. Um, well, I have any pride carrying you around with me because if half my crew already seen you stark naked, um, that could be a problem. Anyway, let's go in. Fastest way, honestly, is dancing and that's what I'm doing. So, okay. I'm yeah, she, has two, she has two kids. I'm sorry if I said she didn't have kids. They're telling me in the comments. She has two kids. Okay. Yes, seventeen and thirteen. They're both taller than me. I'm only five two. Seventeen and thirteen. Um, okay. Okay. That's why she um, like tall okay. guys. So would you stop dancing for your new guy? Um, I plan to be done dancing by March. I have some goals that I danced the first time to open my business, and now I'm dancing to pay off debt. So if my goals are met, then I will stop. You know, but um you know me and my kids come first i got goals so okay you know that's another thing you're a mother and you're stripping and you're a kid you're you have a 17 year old kid pretty soon he's gonna be able to go in the in, in the like he's gonna be able to go in some of these clubs well i don't know I don't know if it's 21 or 18 or whatever, but the point is you got a 17 year old and you stripping. I, I'm sure the boys know about this. It's, it's not a good look. It's just not a good look. Anyway, let's go. I feel you on that. She, she, her, her kids come first. So why do you think you're single now? Um, I, I ended my last relationship. He had a gambling problem and I decided to end it. And I've never been single before, so I don't know. I'm just single because I want better, I guess. Because she wants better. All right, this is Philly, South Carolina. All right, her last guy had a gambling problem, so that's why she's sh stripping to pay those debts. Uh, he, so, so my guess is, and this is just a guess, he must have had access to her or they shared an account or a credit card. And he was swiping, making bets in Vegas or something. And and she noticed that he done charged up the card. And it's in her name, too. Probably dropped her credit and all that stuff. And now she's stripping to pay that off. Um, okay. Anyway, um, let me go ahead and give her a ranking. Check this out.
And there you have it. Yo, she was she was nice looking and everything, but you know, I wasn't really feeling the whole, you know, chilling out in the in the club thing. You know, I thought that was a little much, but nonetheless, she she, she was all right. So let me go ahead and rank her. I'm gonna give her face a seven. Uh, as for her body, I thought her body was okay. I mean, she's a dancer and everything, but at the same time, I'm wondering. I had some questions about that um, that that derriere back there. I thought it, I, it looked like it was probably a botched BBL, but I'm not gonna go off that. I'm gonna just say her body was a seven. As for her personality. Um, look, I thought her personality was okay. The only, well, I gave her personality a 5.5. Okay. And the reason I did that is because her personality seems like, you know, she, she got a kid. She's, she's, you know, she's stripping and she got like almost grown sons and she's at the club taking it off and exposing, you know, everything. And, you know, she got married. She had, she got pregnant at 14. She had like, it's, it's, it's really messy, even though she didn't seem to have a bad personality per se, but I just questioned some of the decision-making now she kind of made up ground by saying she has her own, you know, business and she's going to stop in March and stuff like that. So she kind of made up ground, but, um, just some questionable things going on there, but, all that for a grand total of 19.5 points. Okay. Did I get it right? Did I get it wrong? What would you give her? Y'all put it in the comments. Hit that like, share, and subscribe. All right. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.